Spectators in Brevard County are waiting for a Falcon 9 rocket to lift off. We're excited. Yeah. Beautiful night. The launch window is scheduled to open in just under an hour at 6.53. Channel 9's Roy Ramos is live along the Indian River. Roy, this may be the first time many people have seen a rocket launch, but it's not the first time that this particular rocket is going to space. Greg, this is not the first time that this rocket has taken off from the Kennedy Space Center. In fact, it's already on the launch pad getting ready to take off. We are already starting to see spectators also waiting for this two-hour window, window to open in just under an hour. Hours before SpaceX is scheduled to launch a Falcon 9 rocket, Pam Nuck arrived to pick out her spot off the Indian River, where she will watch the 229-foot rocket take flight. I've seen them go up in the sky. It's always really fascinating. Learned it will carry a communication satellite into geostationary orbit 22,000 miles over the equator. Once in place, it will begin its 15 year mission, broadcasting channels and relaying video for SES and EchoStar, two of the world's largest satellite operators. Dale Ketchum with Space Florida told me why the customer is able to send this payload up at a discounted price. This will be the third time that SpaceX is using a flight-proven vehicle. That's right. This Falcon 9 rocket has already launched from the Kennedy Space Center once before, and it is ready to take off once again. Is this something that is going to be the norm? Yep. Uh, that's the plan. Uh, that's the business model that SpaceX and Blue Origin are pursuing. While it has yet to be determined how often a rocket can be used safely, Ketchum and SpaceX are still reluctant to consider the reusable rockets as routine. And this is still space flight, it's still dangerous. Um, but the goal is to get to a routine manner of doing business. It's something you never would have thought of when I was a youngster. And as we come back out live, it may be a little difficult to see that rocket on the launch pad off in the distance, but we are told that that window is still expected to open at 6.53 p.m. We will be here for that. We'll bring it to you live on Channel 9 Eyewitness News. Here in Brevard County, Roy Ramos, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.